Hello YouTube, this is version 2.0 of my solar camping battery pack. I changed the whole case to something that actually has wheels. And instead of just holding just the solar pack itself, it also holds a few other items inside. But before I show inside, I'll show how it's set up. This is a $20 little tote from Walmart has the handle that can extend even further for moving it around. I use the back hand grip and put my old three cigarette lighter adapter into it. And on the front here I put two little brackets so I can rest the solar panel at roughly the correct angle to collect sun. Now let me take the solar panel off. Put it to the side. Now inside the unit, if you pop off the top, uh, put that down, you will find my original batteries. I got my bigger one here, my smaller one down below. They are now wired into a 20 amp DC breaker, which is my main power on and off. My original EP solar charge controller mounted to the sidewall. And there's the back side of the cigarette lighter adapter. Everything is from my original kit. The only thing that is currently missing is the meters. I took out the meters because I wanted to be a little more compact. But for anyone on YouTube that views this, I have a question for you. I don't want the nice big meters I had before, which I will link to my original video in the description. I want to get like a small little digital that I can throw off here in the corner that can read volts and amps. But I only want to pay $15 for it, roughly. So if anyone has any suggestions, please leave it in the comments. Also, the power from the solar panel, I can pass right through here to a nice little low amperage connector and that feeds directly into the solar input of the charge controller this way I can pull it off and the solar panel gets stored right back here and I also have my DC fan which I usually use in my bedroom at night and right here basically just a 2x3 stud that I took some elastic mounted up there it holds two of my power cords one for the fan, one for my solar camping lantern I also have stored in here. And my little cheapo $1 LED lights I got from Walmart. Little solar lights. So this is my whole setup. Again, if anyone has any ideas for a amp slash volt digital meter that I can shove in here, that can read at least 10 if not 15 amps because the charge controller can handle 10 amps so 15 would be a good little increase just for safety margin that I can put here or right around here some little thing like 1 inch or 2 inch by 3 inches or something like that for like 15 bucks please let me know and then we just one other item I forgot to put in there my DC motor DC motor that pumps up the air bed. So we close it up. Clips on and just throw the solar panel back up top again. And again, just for comparison, I will link to my version 1 box from last year down in the description.